hi there my beautiful people welcome back to my channel my name is sue i know it's been a long time without me posting here it's not that long but i've had some challenges with my channel i've experienced some 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 challenges but yeah i'm working on them i'm working on them yeah of course with the help of some people and uh I'm just thrilled to be here again to be filming another video for you guys and it's going to be a makeup video it's going to be um uh I think I'm going to do uh <laughs> I'm not even sure what I'm going to do yet um there's a couple of few gifts that I want to show you I received from friends those who know that I love makeup they get they gifted me with some nice nice gifts uh first there is this uh color eyeshadow palette from beauty glaze it's just too cute too adorable it has shades it has colors it has the gold the the, the shimmer the purple the the the, um, the green tones blue green it is just too adorable it's my lovely book right now my favorite book to read <laughs> so it came with these um brushes again they're just too soft they're just too adorable i love them can't wait to use them and then of course i got this slick now this one i bought it myself uh, it still has um, the sticker is stuck on it but it's from slick and uh, i would love to use it hopefully it's not way too dark for my tone and uh, yeah let's just begin the video and uh, i'm just so excited to be here hopefully you will watch through i know i've done a lot of talking but it's because i've been missing this a lot guys i just wanted to sit down and film for you guys <laughs> Yeah, uh, of course we're going to start with hydrating the skin. I'm going to be using this hydrating primer. Uh, it's from uh, Sleek, if you can see that. So it's the primer, as you can see. Ooh, wow, that's some kind of drip. Why is it coming out like that? Okay, so let's prime the skin and close that first. So I later on switched to a voice cover because my background was too noisy. There were kids having fun outside the plane. So as usual, I started with my brows and uh, just lining them out, combing it out, doing all the process. Yeah. Then next, I'm going to clean them out with my Pro Concealer. It's in that shade Toffee. Yeah, as usual, I, I always have to go with little products. It's easier to work with little products. Then after that, I'm going to move to clean my upper brows using a foundation, of course. So then for my eyebrows, for my um, eyelid, that is we're moving on to the eyeshadow i'm going to be priming it with the uh, elega pro concealer but you can use eye primer if you've got that now moving on to the palette book i'm going to be using these two shades first okay that is working with the brown half it didn't show too much on the camera but um it was there trust me it was there Now next I'm moving on to the orange. I will be applying it up. It's not that orange but kind of orange. You know those colors. Eh? So I'm going to be applying it up on the brown and uh, try to fade them in together so they can really come out soft. Now I'm going to move on with the blue. That's a deep blue. Yeah. So I'll be applying it on my outer corner of the eye using a fluffy brush and uh, just uh, using that motion as you can see 
Yeah, then I didn't want the blow to take or to, 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 to get lost because that was dark. So I went ahead and used that lighter blue. Yeah. So that I can still maintain my blue. So again, moving on to a book. I'm gonna go again with the brown and then I try to um, blend it with the blue okay so we can have some smooth transitioning now moving on to the next part that's the cut crease yeah we're going to uh, cut our crease <laughs> yeah that's the simple technique that I'm gonna use just apply a small dot and then log up it's gonna give me the way where I'm going to start mapping my cut crease and uh yeah so moving back to our palette i'm gonna get those two blue and i try to blend the cut the, the concealer with the blue okay because we are always looking for smooth transitionings always now on my cut crease area i'm going to go with this uh blue glitter glitter so now after applying our glitter we are going to get the blue again of course we need smooth transitioning i'll keep on saying that so we are going to um try and blend that in okay so it can look more natural now, you know, when you're working with glitters, it keeps on falling off. So we have to clean that as well. Now for my face foundation, I'll be using the Slick. It's my first time using it and I loved it. Okay, so I'll be using my foundation brush and apply that on my skin. So to blend that, I will be using a beauty blender and I want to use a damp beauty blender. So I'm spraying it with the setting spray, but of course you can use water. You just need a damp blender. Now for the back area, I'll be using a dark cocoa concealer and I'll be applying it using that technique. Don't forgetting you always want to blend your products in you want them to dissolve into your skin you don't want maps on your face okay so just blend everything in so for the um, powder setting powder i'm going to be using this deep banana it's from revolution okay using a fluffy brush we're going to blush that off now for my under eye i will be using a black and a blue eyeliner they really really did a great job for the lips i'll go with this uh, shine shine lip gloss it's from essence and then after that i'm gonna get my highlighter it's the glow to go again from essence and highlight that nose a little bit then i will be spraying my makeup i'll be spraying my face okay using this from manhattan and voila we are done with our makeup let me know how it looks and uh thank you so much guys for working for watching sorry i will be seeing you again in my next video stay safe stay blessed and i love you all guys i really really appreciate your support your genuine support may god bless you all for me all guys Bye.